right side. Lee stops up right wing half wall. His pass deflected high in the air and it's gloved down by Chilliwack far corner. Lombardi has it. Backhand pass to the middle blue line. Powell Connor lets it go. Kick save. Rebound scores. <laughs> front of the net, jumping on the rebound. Mike Lombardi opens the scoring for the Chilliwack Chiefs. 2.41 into the first period. Shot and a rebound. Hildebrand made the good kick save with his left pad on the initial shot. It got deflected, I think, off his own player. And then the rebound was just sitting right at the side of the net. And Lombardi, kind of doing a flyby of the goal, was able to chip it over top of Hildebrand's outstretched glove. So 2.41 into the first period. Chilliwack opens the scoring. Back for Albi, middle line. He tried to drop it off. Puck knocked forward by Owen Sillinger. Trying to get a shorthanded break. Diving play, Albi. Sillinger, backhand chance is stopped by Schnard. In front, oh, what a stop. Rebound, scores! Chris Clack with a shorthanded goal ties this game up. 9.02 left in the first period. Wow, can't fault Daniel Chenard on that play. He made two grade A stops and the third one with two defensemen draped all over him. Chris Clack was still able to get that one home. Owen Sillinger, a backhand breakaway was stopped. He threw it in front. Clack was robbed by the right pad. And then while falling forward, Clack was able to sweep that puck past and outstretch Daniel Chenard. So a huge shorthanded goal for the V's. And Chris Clack gets his first of the season to tie this game up. So a shorthanded goal for Penticton, and Chris Clack ties the game up. Back to even strength as Powell Connor flies down the right wing for Chilliwack. Try to hook it in front, loose at the side of the goal, and they score! Puck thrown towards the net from the near side corner, a one-handed shovel at the goal, and it looked like it went off the skate of Nolan Hildebrand, and then it was in the crease. Maybe the Chiefs were jamming away at it, and it sneaks past Hildebrand. Powell Connor just kind of one-hands it towards the goal. Hit Hildebrand's skate and the post. And at the side of the goal was Ryan Miato who jammed at it. It went in. So it looks like Miato is going to get his first goal of the season. And the Chiefs quickly regain their one goal lead. Steps around the defender and comes through center. O'Connell will feather it left wing side. Bowes couldn't keep control. Dakota Butan there as well trying to work it down the far side boards. Six seconds left and four on four. O'Connell has the puck in his skates in the slot. Backhand scores! Cassidy Bowes was standing in front. Not sure if he got a piece of it. Another four on four goal for the Penticton V's. And it looks like Bowes did get the goal. 5.07 left in the second period. This game is tied at two. O'Connell has been very noticeable here tonight for all the right reasons. Kicks the puck to himself, backhand feed in front. What a nice little tip by Cassidy Bowes. All alone in front of the goal. Technically, this is Cassidy Bowes' first career goal. He played in the playoffs last year, had two goals and two assists against uh, the Chilliwack Chiefs in the final, but he hadn't scored in the regular season. So technically, that's Cassidy Bowes' first career goal. That's a big one to tie this zone. game up. Works it up the near side wall. Barnes kicks it to himself. Here's Allen right wing side cutting to the middle. Allen Shields throws it on goal. Hit a leg and went wide. Tyconic swings it in front. Here's Ben Allen. Drops it off. Massimo Rizzo. Fanned on the snapshot. Drops it off right point for Allen. Long shot. Deflected off a stake and ends up near corner. Barnes behind the net again. Rizzo looking in front. Backhand feed. Chopped away by Chilliwack. Lieberman fakes the shot. Left point. Nice move. Walking in. Lieberman shot. Scores! Oh, what a goal from Nicky Lieberman. His first career BCH goal, BCHL goal is incredible. And the V's have their first lead of the night. 2.15 left in the second period. It's now 3-2. What a move by Nicky Lieberman. Fakes the slap shot at the left point. Breaks the ankles of the defender coming up front. And then toe drags around another. Releases that heavy wrist shot right into the top corner. What a goal by Nicky Lieberman. Colorado Avalanche draft pick. And he showed why on that play there. The V's have their first lead of the game. Off the face, thought that was offside, maybe not. V's recover, they might have a chance to come out three on one. Here's a right wing feed for Jared Nash at the right circle. Nash, snapshot, scores! Goals in quick succession for the Penticton V's. Jared Nash has his second of the season, and the V's now lead four to two with a minute 41 left in the second period. 
Chiefs aggressively working their way up the ice, trying to get some chances on goal, and it cost them. V's come in three on one. I think Nash almost fanned on that shot, but he still managed to get it past the goaltender, Chenard. And Nash, second goal of the year, had five all of last year. He's got two in five games now. And the V's now have doubled their lead. It's four to two with a minute 41 left in the second period. 18% coming into the game. Chilliwack's penalty kill was 82.1 coming into tonight. Off the draw, left point. Lieberman will go across right circle for Jackson Keane. He's got it inside the circle. Now goes back right point for Massimo Rizzo. Here's Keane again. Drops it off. Rizzo high slot. Rizzo shot scores. I don't think it was deflected in front, so that might be Massimo Rizzo's first career BC Hockey League goal. A power play goal just 15 seconds into the man advantage, and Penticton now leads 5-2. Rizzo had a fantastic showing at the Western Canada Cup last year with Penticton as an affiliate player with five points in five games. Also had a goal in the finals against Chilliwack, but again, those goals don't technically count as your first career goal. So Massimo Rizzo gets on the board with his first career goal, and the Vs have exploded here in this second period for four goals, and they now lead 5-2. to two. Off for Bhutan. Nice backhand right-wing feed for Cassidy Bowes. Right circle into the slot. Oh, and Sillinger scores! Happy birthday, Owen Sillinger. Exactly 10 minutes into the third period. Sillinger's got his fourth goal of the season, and the Penticton Bees now have a 6-2 lead. What better way to celebrate your birthday than scoring, right? Nice pass to the slot from Cassidy Bowes, and Owen Sillinger lets that wrist shot go. Beats Daniel Chenard on the glove side. And the V's have extended their lead with their second power play goal of the game. Moving towards the middle of the ice, Tommy Lee now left point, all the way to the left circle. Look at him go, Tommy Lee, fan of the shot, goes below the goal and pass in front. And Donovsky, one-timer, kick, save, rebound, scores! Not much you could do about that one, and now Johnny Tychonics getting into it with a Chiefs player below the goal line. Tough one from Nolan Hilderman makes a great save on a one-timer right from the slot, but the rebound lands right to his blocker side, and really nothing he could do to stop that second chance. I'm not even sure who got it after the scuffle at the side of the net. Looks like maybe the captain, Will Calverly. Tommy Lee is getting fist bumps down the bench, so maybe it was Tommy Lee. And hey, like I said, Jason Tatonic loves to pull the goalie with a lot of time left on the clock. And hey, look at that, it works out. Gets a six on four power play goal. 522 left in the third period, and it's now 6-3. And Tychonic's gonna go to the penalty box after that, though he did take a Chiefs player with him. So the Chiefs have now cut it down to a 6-3 lead. 522 left here in the third net. Ethan Bowen goes across to the far side wall and lifting that puck out to center was Wellsby. Kenny Johnson at center. Jack Barnes dumps the puck in for Penticton as the V's improve to 4-0 on the season here. Another come from behind victory at the showcase 6-3 against the Chilliwack Chiefs. Nice bounce back performance from Nolan Hildebrand. He's excited, fired up. His team is fired up. They get two power play goals, a lot of career firsts in this game for the Penticton Bees. Six to three winners over the Chilliwack Chiefs. 4-0 on the season, and guess what? This whole BCHL showcase has been going on now for six years. The Bees have never lost at the BCHL showcase. They are now 12-0 over the last six years. A 6-3 win against the Chilliwack Chiefs. We're going to take a break.